Well, this is always a pretty comfortable save for Mark Bosnich. Straight above him, always rising. The goalkeeper taking no chances trying to catch it, just pushing it over. Then Daly's got the chance. Tony Daly's got the goal. And Aston Villa have taken the lead. That's a great strike when he's left foot, Tony Daly. They rode the luck a little. There's great thinking by Andy Townsend. Watch the way he steps over this. Now he wants a one-two. The Dean Saunders didn't quite deliver it. They get lucky there. But I tell you, there's nothing lucky about the strike. Beautifully clean hit strike. Over goes Townsend. He wanted it straight back in his path. It broke a couple of times. But what a lovely finish from Tony Daly. Support on his right, Fenton going out of your picture with the fast bowlers run up. But Saunders takes Teal. Fenton's got it back. He's certainly not a bashful character. The lad from the northeast. There's a bit of taunting for the home supporters from the Villa fans. Out on by Atherton. Darby getting the better of Richardson. Now, can Coventry move on from here? Saunders lets it run. Parker coming on to it. Having to shoot on the stretch. It's a good break from Aston Villa. Fenton did ever so well on the far side. He was looking for a bit of a pass in. Saunders steps over, but the first touch, look at it. It's too far in front of Gary Parker. Phil Babb knew that, you watched his defending. He wasn't rushed into making a challenge. The touch is too strong. It gets too far away from him, and it can only stretch. Plenty of analysis from Messrs Townsend and Richardson. Townsend takes. It's met defensively by Flynn, put back in by Teal. Echog. Darby with the block. Parker. Cox. Townsend trying to take it in his stride. Parker. Not fully away by Burrows either. He was just able to get a toe to it to stop Richardson working the give and go with Saunders. And there's a break on here for Williams. And Love is in the middle. Quinn is there. Derby's arriving as well. Williams gets his cross in. And Love. Williams. Rennie, Saunders chasing back. Atherton. Oh. Well, it sat up nicely for the strike. Dwyer, who was a judge to have conceded the two penalties at Spurs on Wednesday. His heart must have been in his mouth then. Well, it would be, Mark, because this is a nightmare. It's a nightmare for referees. What he's going to decide is that a tangle of legs does he make a tackle? I don't think Neil Cox made an attempted tackle on there. Handball, not given. <laughs> well, the referee ruling here that there was a lack of intent. Well, you can't accuse Keith Hackett of being uh, a homer when it comes to... Uh, Refereeing and favouring Coventry City. Two strong shouts for a penalty. Well, I didn't think there was any doubt that it comes off Sean Teal's arm. And as you say, is it because he's so close? Now, I think when they're close together, Mark, then a player's got his arms by his side, then you can say lack of intent. But I always think it's, it's dodgy when a player's arms go up in the air and then the ball stop from going into the penalty area. And I think they may have a case there for a penalty. Saunders with a cross. The cross and OK. But look at the right arm, it's, it's way up there. I mean, what is it doing up there in the first place then? And I know they're close. Why? Keith Hackett was perfectly placed. 
Gary Parker had no margin as he filled in as the last line of defence. But he preserved the lead. Atherton, further away this time. Well, that's as close as Coventry have come by some margin. We often talk about people on the goal line. And here, Villa can thank both players. I think Tony Daly's the one that gets in the way of that. He is. But look at Parker. If he'd have left there, then that's a goal. But watch that. Right? Off Daly first. Stands big as he thinks it's going in. Look at Parker. Reacts so well. Now is that over? Look straight behind Parker. The referee's there. Immediately signals no. Bam. Rennie's going in. Opportunity for Coventry that they can't take with the, a value of them. Well, if you want to know the value, there it is. You put in a decent cross, people will get in there. Boys, you see Boys and Teal furious there because they just go to sleep in the last seconds of the game. And then Love hits this very well indeed. But I have to say, once again, that's a fine save from the Villa goalkeeper. Coventry. Time added on. Grizovic has come up. Oh, and he was moving in behind Richardson. The Coventry goalkeeper has to go back now. For a humbling experience here last season.